What's going on guys, it's Adonis, and today we're gonna to be doing an unboxing and a quick little overview of the smart keyboard from Apple. Let's get into it. So Apple announced two accessories specifically for the iPad Pro at launch, which are the smart keyboard and the Apple Pencil. Both were not available launch day, but today I had the ability to get one from the Apple Store, which was the smart keyboard. So we're gonna unbox this, connect it to the iPad Pro, and get some first impressions. And this is the smart keyboard in all its smart glory. So we're gonna go ahead and open this. Side. And here it is. So, wow, that's, that is weird. So I gotta try to explain this to you guys. It's like a, it's a fabric. That's what it feels like. It's like woven. I know they said it's like a, some woven, special Apple woven fabric, but you could feel the texture. It's, it's not, it, that's really weird. You can actually see some of the fabric moving. Um, I'm not sure if that's a feature of it, <laughs> but it feels really nice. The, I mean, really nice. Wow. Um, I'm trying to kind of get an idea of what this feels like. It's really hard to explain. Um, you have this microfiber feel on the back. Um, when it closes like this. Now, how it connects is it utilizes this connector here, smart connector that is, um, I'll put it here so it's in focus, but the smart connector here, there's three dots on the iPad that it'll attach to. Um, and when connected, it will actually dock there and the iPad will sit directly there for you guys. Um, really, really interesting. Um, yeah, it's, it's just a different feel. Like it doesn't feel like anything that I've ever used as far as typing on. Now I haven't used a Surface keyboard at length, so I'm not really 100% sure what that keyboard feel is, but it doesn't feel like this. Um, it's not like a felt feel, it's, it feels like a fabric. It's just really weird, um, but it's comfortable. Like the keyboard spacing is nice. Um, it's a nice satisfying click to them. It doesn't feel like a very short travel like the MacBook. But yeah, I mean, that's, it feels really good. That's all I know. Let's connect it and try some stuff out. So I have it set up for you guys here so you guys can get an idea of what this will look like. Um, you have a lot of functionality that you would on a Mac. So if I do Command Tab, you have the ability to jump from app to app. Um, really awesome. Command spacebar gives you spotlight, which is awesome. Now I'm trying to reach around the, <laughs> the camera, so bear with me. So um, it's actually extremely comfortable. I didn't think it was gonna be this comfortable. It just, it feels really nice. I don't know what else to say. You have your tabs, how you would on a regular keyboard, cat locks as well. Um, I mean, it's fantastic. It feels really natural. Doesn't feel um, like a smaller version of a keyboard. You have your emojis there. I mean, it's great. I wanna see if Command Find would work. It does, that's crazy. So Command F, I can bring up and type in iMac, and it should allow me to search for things. Bang. So it says two out of 29 matches, and I can go through these, and that's awesome. So it's weird, there's like OS 10 features built into this keyboard. If I Command T, it opens up a new tab, so that's awesome, so I can tab that forever. So I like that. So I wanna show you what this looks like. Um, when you don't want to use it as a keyboard. 
So I'm gonna undock the bottom part. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the keyboard and bring it towards the back like this. When you do that, you're able to use it just as a stand. And I can, you know, use Safari, but you'll see the on-screen keyboard pop up because we're not using the keyboard as a keyboard at the moment. So really clever that it allows you to do that and it knows it just how it sits when it when it magnetizes down when the keyboard's out. So really awesome. So you can use it just for viewing videos if you want, if you don't want to use it uh, with the keyboard. So it's cool that it gives you double duty. It's not just a keyboard stand, so you can use it as a traditional stand. So I like that a lot. And then when you put it back down and dock it regularly like this, and you go to search, keyboard comes up. And you can type here, bang. Pretty awesome. So that'll do it for my first impressions, guys. Let me know in the comment section what your thoughts are on this smart keyboard and some things you would like me to cover for the review. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and do so. APP logo in the corner, or if you're on mobile, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you like the video, go ahead and show me some love. Hit that like button as well. All right, guys, till next time. See you later. Thanks again for watching, guys. If you guys like this video and wanna see more content like this, go ahead and click that APP logo in the corner to subscribe to the channel. Also, if you guys wanna chat with me on social media, go ahead and like my Facebook page, Absolutely Tech, and follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Adonis underscore ATMLV. All right, guys, till next time. See you later.